welcome to Safari's Yoga. We're going to be looking at the warrior pose with forward bend stretch uh, in a flow. Really good for a quick pick me up and uh, before your meditation. So follow along with me. Stand in the side in Tadasana. Feel the feet rooting towards the ground. Relax the rib cage, relax the shoulders, have the chin parallel to the floor. Toes facing forward. Keep the weight of your body in the center. Take your time and feel your posture. Take your time to experience the breath. Take your time to experience the tension in your body. And close your eyes, relax your shoulders. Press down the big toe, middle toe, little toe, and the heel down towards the ground. Lift the inner arches of the feet. Squeeze the glutes, activate the front of your thigh muscles, draw the navel in, draw the shoulders in. Chin parallel to the floor. Breathe in, arms round by the side, turn the palms up, draw the shoulder blades together. Bring the palms together. Keeping the ribs down, squeezing the glutes, breathe in. Keep the weight of your body centered. Bring the prayer to the heart. Breathe in, take the prayer up towards the heavens. Squeeze the glutes and take the prayer behind you. Draw the shoulder blades down. Draw the abs in, squeeze the each shoulder blades. Arms by the side. Take the hips back and squat. Bring your fingers down, squeeze the glutes and take the right leg back. The right leg at 45 degrees, heel in line with the inner arches of the right foot. Keep the outside of the foot of the right foot active, knee in line with the ankle, draw the abs in, squeeze the glutes and come up into the warrior. Mandir's cord at the fingertips, pulling your arms from the socket, yet you're drawing the shoulder blades together. Squeeze the buttock of the right leg, firm the ground, feet down into the ground. Turn the left foot in, toes facing forward. Draw the arms into the sockets. Squeeze the shoulder blades together at the back. Squeeze the glutes, breathe in. And exhale, we're gonna do five, breathe in. And two, breathe in. And three, breathe in. And four, and last one, breathe in. And five, be mindful that the arms are in a line. If you're looking for alignment, turn the palms up, keep the shoulders down. Okay, and now palms down towards the floor. Bring the fingertips to the hip sockets and pressing the toes, feet down. You're gonna hinge from the hips, take the hips back, take the hips back, body midline and bring your body towards the right side, left side of your foot. If you need a block, you place a block. Keep the legs straight, keep the outside of your feet working and stay there for five breaths. Breathe in, exhale, breath in, exhale, breath in, exhale, Last one, breath in, exhale. Ten your fingers 
towards the center and five breaths. Breathe in, exhale, breathe in, keep the outsides of the feet active, exhale, breathe in, exhale, breathe in, exhale, once more breath in, exhale, now turn your fingertips to the other side, the right side, breathe in, exhale, 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 last one, breathe in, exhale, turn the right foot out, okay, bring your fingertips to the inside of your right foot, the outside of your left foot, place it down towards the ground, draw the abs in, the ribs in, squeeze the glutes, and then slowly pressing the feet down, come into warrior. Draw the shoulder blades together. Imagine there's a cord pulling either side of your fingertips. Keep the feet grounded. Five breaths. Keep the glutes squeezed. Outside of your foot active. Front of your foot active. Lift the inner arches. Keep the hips buoyant. Last breath. Take the left hand over. Hold. Five breaths. And then we're going to bring the left foot forward. Knees track it. And slowly come up. Breath in. Turn the palms up. Shoulders down, exhale. Breath in. Exhale. Five. Breathe in. Exhale. Three. Breathe in. Exhale. Four. Breathe in. Exhale. Five. Breathe in. Squeeze the glutes, draw the abs in, draw the ribs in, draw the shoulder blades down, squeeze the glutes, from the abs, keep the feet down, arms, and forward, breathe in, two, three, four, and five, keep your fingertips down. Take the right leg back. Keep the heel in line with the right foot. Keep the feet active, draw the abs in. Keep the ribs in, press down the right foot and left. Warrior, keep the hips buoyant. Keep the feet active. Keep the knees tracking the foot. Imagine that there's a cord pulling you. Keep the body to the center. Five breaths. Take the left foot in. Toes facing in. Draw the shoulder blades together. And fire star lateral arm raises. Breathe in. Exhale. Last one. Keep your fingertips on your hip socket. Take the hips back. 
come forward, lengthen your spine. Lengthen your spine, take the left hand, place it towards the left, take your hands, place it towards the left toe, and hold for four, five breaths. Bring your fingertips to the center. Align your body. Make sure that the weight of the body is in the center. Breathe in five. Keep the outsides of the feet active. Take your fingertips to the right. Breathe in. Take the right foot out. Ground the feet, ground the outside of the foot, knee tracking the ankle, come up, squeeze the glute of the left, particular press down, anchor the front and the rear foot. Okay, keep the hips buoyant. Imagine there's a cord pulling out, draw the shoulder blades together. Keep the ribs in. Five breaths. And come forward. Over. Lunging forward. Squeeze the gluteal. And bring the left foot forward. Ground your feet. Slowly come up. Press the ground away. Slowly come up. One vertebra at a time. One vertebra at a time. Coming to the center. Standing up straight. Turn the palms up. One, five, squeeze the glutes, two, three, four, and five. We're going to finish this off with the plank. And coming onto your elbows, and you're going to hold this for 10 breaths. Draw the abs in tight, draw the ribs in tight, squeeze the glutes. Getting the knees down, taking the hips back. And five breaths, relax, 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 relax. Namaste. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please press a like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. If you have any comments, let me know and I'll get back to you. In the meantime, do this flow whenever you need to pick up on your energy and doing it slowly, just that one round is more than enough, okay? Look at your alignment. Get the core stability in, shoulder stability and hip stability and keep your feet grounded, okay? Have a grounding day and see you again soon. Namaste.